Georgia appears to have broken its record for early vote turnout in a single day, according to Gabriel Sterling, the chief operating officer for the Georgia Secretary of State. More than 300,000 Georgians voted early on Monday, shattering a previous early voting record of over 233,000 votes in one day. This brings the total number of votes cast in the state's Senate runoff to over 500,000, according to the Secretary of State's office, and there are still four days of early voting left, plus Election Day is on December 6. The counties with the highest turnout are Fulton and DeKalb counties, where Atlanta and its suburbs are located. In the January 2021 Senate runoff election, over 2 million people voted before Election Day, so it's possible that a similar number of people could vote early this year, too. The main difference between then and now, though, is that in 2021, there were two marquee Senate races on the runoff ballot, and the result of both races was crucial in determining which party would control the Senate for two years. This year, Democrats have already won 50 Senate seats and with Vice President Kamala Harris's vote, they have control of the Senate. And, there is only one Senate contest on the ballot this year. Ben Commissar is a deputy political editor in NBC's political unit. Bridget Bowman is a deputy editor for NBC's political unit. Alexandra Marquez is a researcher for the NBC News political unit.